I just want to arrive to my best level. For me, the perfect coach right now is Antonello because he is a good human being and I feel it's the first time that happened to me that someone cared what do you have inside. My mom is everything because she gave up a lot to give me and give my brothers and, and now she's far only because she want a better life for us. So I feel like I have to do it because she deserves it. I just want to arrive to my best level, you know, that's my dream, that's my goal, is what I'm doing, but then I'm, I'm studying psychology, so I want to be a good therapy too for the sport people. So I started doing dance, ballet, uh, I was all the time in the gym, like for 10 hours, so one day one of the coaches he asked me like why I don't try to play basketball, I was like, no, okay, maybe tomorrow I go to practice. So I went to practice, and when I started practicing with them, I like it because it's like a teamwork. And from the day that I touch the ball, I'm in love with basketball, so I start like this. For me, it's an honor to play in the national team, but I feel it's different because national team is only a short period that you are playing with uh, different players every year and then playing with a club like you are like nine months together so you can build really something special so for me that's a different like national team is just a short time but of course with people that maybe you know and then a season for me is different because it's nine months that I'm working with the same people with the same players so for me it's more like intimacy you know the part of the club I think I'm a positive, uh, positive teammate. I think I always try to give my 100% inside and outside. And I feel like I'm a giver, you know, I will try to give the team what they need and I will try to give everything 100% that I have. And I'm one of the biggest in the league, so I need to like really work on myself to get more in the team because we run fast. We are really like, you know, trying to adapt our identity, but our identity is running fast. We have amazing shooters, amazing passers. So I just need to adapt myself to this, you know, new environment. Last season they didn't have a big one and this season they have a big one. So I think everybody we are trying to adapt. So you know, Diana, she's not only American, she's Argentina and, and everything. And I feel like when I read her story, everything this was explained, I was feeling that I'm like her. You know, she was taking care of her family. She went to stay, she moved on. Um, I moved my house when I was 14 years old. I was a baby, you know, I'm now 26. I'm still not in home, really. So I feel like everything that she was explaining, the hard working, you know, to arrive to that level that she arrived, I feel I want to be with her. So for me, it's like a role model that I want to be, you know, and for me, I believe in hard work. I don't really believe in lucky, you know, you're lucky when you, when you got to something, it's because you work hard to arrive there, so I believe in that. So I would take Deborah for sure, because she's a fighter, you know, she, uh, what I feel about her in the core, that she's gonna fight all the time, 40 minutes. For me, the perfect coach right now is Antonello, not because I'm here and I, because he is a good human being, but he's a good coach. And he has the two things. And sometimes you can have good days, bad days, bad games, but he understands. We are human beings, we're not robots. You know, we expose to the public all the time, and you never know how player is feeling inside. And I feel like it's the first time that happened to me that someone cared what do you have inside. Because when you're okay here, and here you can give a lot of more. So I feel like he's the first coach in my life that he really cared in both sides. I have amazing coaches, bad coaches, I have everything. And you know with time, you experience. I have another coach too that I have to say that is Roberto Iniguez. Now he's coaching in Girona, but he was my coach in Avenida. And for me, I have the hardest and the best year in the same time because I was in Euroleague. He helped me to arrive to Euroleague, to play in Euroleague. So I have to give him that, that, you know, name. But Antonello is just involved, you know? So, yeah. 
my mom, uh, she came in Spain with 70 years old, you know, to have a better life. She's coming from Africa. She came really young and alone. And so she was studying and working in the same time. So she gave everything for us. Like she's a hard worker. She's still working, but it's true. Like, thank you that I'm professional. I can help her and I want to give what I have to my brothers. So I'm kind of like the second mommy for them. But my mom is everything because she gave up a lot to give me and give my brothers. And uh, my father, he was not in home, he was far. So for my mom to raise four kids alone is so hard. My father, he couldn't come in that year, you know. So you see my mom waking up at 5 a.m. to work every day, making breakfast before to go to, to work. For me, it's something that I have to give her something. And she don't wanna be in Spain all her years. She wanna go to back to her home, it's her home. And now she's far only because she want a better life for us. So I feel like I have to do it because she deserves it. Came to watch our game. I hope I see you soon, guys. And ciao. <laughs>